Hello everyone, anyone, and welcome back to Fallout 4. Zial, Zial Gaming, etc. All that stuff. If you're watching this episode, you probably know who I am. <laughs> um, but you may not, so that's why you make an introduction every single time. Now, I have a feeling this is probably playing a radio station that I can't hear. But, wait. There you are. Interesting. I might just have to do that. Oh, okay, there you go. Map updated. Gave you a little map update. Um, last time we took on the raiders out here, and I spent a little bit of time um, inside of the facility trying to find. Ooh. Yes. Uh, tried to find the what's it called safe that I got a safe key for. I didn't see it. I spent a little time doing it, and this is before uh, I had the recording up. But the game froze out of me. Now, granted, complaining about Bethesda games when they first come out freezing up on you or breaking is kind of like you know spitting in the wind it just doesn't mean it. everyone has the same problem um, it's just one of those things where you just kind of have to accept it that's how it is um, but it could be annoying I'm curious how other people are dealing with that as well I'm sure other people are having things this looks really cool um, blocking melee attack can't block with uh, unless I have a melee weapon. All right, anyway, we're back here. I saved your raider problem. Okay, what do you want? You find those raiders? Yeah. I took care of those raiders for you. I yeah, sure I did. did. That's the best piece of news we've had around here for a good long time. So we've been talking. We decided if you came through for us, we'd join up with the Minutemen again. If we want things to get better, we've got to start helping each other. So we're in. You can count on us if you need help down the line. Thanks again, friend. Yay! So, now that the workshop is opened up, I'm not sure if I need to get more uh, talents to do stuff, but, yeah, see, here's the thing. Now that it's opened up here, uh, things that are left in the other place are located here as well. Um... I believe so that's kind of uh, that so that's very useful so you don't have to go all the way back to sanctuary even though that's what I'm about to do to drop off your stuff so to kind of test my theory or at least what I, I, I read uh, I just put in some Abraxo cleaner um, two so that's the one I can remember and let's uh, fast travel whoosh back to sanctuary and be like yo Preston these people joined up hey they're happier look at that Nuka Cola. Has anyone actually tried the Nuka Cola drink? If you have, let me know in the comments because I'm curious. Uh, God, if they have a Nuka Cola cherry, I'd have to actually try that out just because that's awesome. You need the sight to see that you've done real good for these people. Thanks, Mama Murphy. Hey, I know yeah. you. Hey, Carla, back again. Time to do business. Uh. Sure. Let's see what you got. Always. Uh -huh. And I wonder if, because she's here, if I'm able to like get her to stick around. Anything cool? Eh, rapid submachine gun. I mean, that's kind of neat. Um, for the most part, you know what? Let's just sell off some of the stuff I have. She's got some caps. I got some stuff I'm not using. Uh, yeah, not doing that. And nuke a grenade. Actually, that last one was pretty good. What was the last thing I just tried to sell? Pipe bolt action pistol. Oh, it says uses three oh eight rounds. Jeez. <laughs> um, just throw some of this here because I don't want to deal with it now. And yeah, give me the money. Although, uh, if you really want to uh, do the best you can, you should put on your trading clothes before you talk Carla, to anybody. To something up? What kind of stuff do you have? Oh, okay. A bit of everything. You'd be yep. got plenty to sell. All right. No, I'm good. Not right now. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. All right. Uh, Preston, Childs. Nice job with those defenses. Yeah. Preston always wants to chat. Sometimes he doesn't have anything to say. 
You know that settlement you sent me to help? They've decided to join the Minutemen. That's great news. I knew you were the right person for the job. By the way, you should have one of these flare guns. You can use it to signal for help from any nearby Minutemen. Not much use yet, but once we have more allied settlements, you'll have help whenever you need it. So, there's something I need to ask you. Uh, I don't of think course. I ever told you what happened to the Minutemen. How I ended up as the last one. Is it a sad story? Are you really the last Minuteman? Maybe not literally. There must be a lot of former Minutemen out there who gave it up in disgust after the Quincy Massacre. But we were the last active group of Minutemen. And now, well, it's just me. Quincy? What was the Quincy Massacre? I thought everyone in the Commonwealth knew about that by now. I was with Colonel Hollis's group. A mercenary group called the Gunners was attacking Quincy. The people there called for the Minutemen to help. We were the only ones that came. The other groups, they just turned their backs on us and the folks in Quincy. Only a few of us got out alive. Colonel Hollis was dead. So I ended up in charge of the survivors. We never found a safe place to settle. One disaster after another. You saw how it ended in Conquered. Okay. I what was the, the same Quincy thing. Massacre? I thought everyone. Okay, you're gonna say the same thing. Only a few of us got it. We never found. Uh. Yeah. Know how it feels. I know how it feels to be the last survivor. Yeah. I guess you do. That's why I'm talking to you. I can't rebuild the Minutemen, but I think you can. What about you? Why can't you lead the Minutemen? That's not who I am. I can get my men through a firefight. I can defend a perimeter against all odds. But that's not going to be enough to bring the Minutemen back from the brink. We need someone who can bring the whole Commonwealth together in a common cause. And I think you've got it in you to be that leader. Uh... See, here's the thing. Is it, like, faction-based? So that if I, um... You know... Just because I decided to talk to the Brotherhood of Steel and join up them doing this can cause a problem. Can you explain what the Minutemen are all about? We're citizen soldiers. The people of the Commonwealth banding together to protect ourselves and decide our own future. That was the original idea, and it was a good one. The Minutemen fell apart because our leaders forgot what we were supposed to stand for. I think you're the one who can bring the Minutemen back. Let's... Can I just walk away? Yeah! <laughs> Solved by walking away. Um, I don't know. You know what? The whole point of this whole thing, this whole exercise is to screw things up terribly. Let's hope that the Brotherhood isn't going to be too pissed off. I Excuse say yes. Me. What do you say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Okay. I'll do it. Good. Good. Welcome aboard. I feel like this is a whole new star for the Miniman. And the Commonwealth, too. Don't worry. I'll be right beside you all the way, General. Uh. Why are you calling me General? The leader of the Miniman has always held the rank of General. Our last leader was General Becker. After he died back in 82, nobody could agree on who should take his place. The one good thing about being the last Miniman <laughs> is there's no one to argue with me when I say you're the new General. Now it's your job to make it more than an empty title. I've gotten word about a settlement that's being threatened by raiders. More raiders? Of course, there's raiders. I'll so mark raiders. it on your map. Go find out what they need. We could use more settlements supporting our cause. And he's available as a companion. That's cool. Uh, so just to see if I have uh, messed up everything. I think last time I actually said I, I think I dropped um. One of my divinity let's play is I dropped the F Bob even though I'm trying not to swear. I swear. Let's go we're gonna go back to the station. But I don't want to frell up things. Frell is is instead of just flat out dropping F bombs. Um is from Farscape, sci sci fi show. I'm not sure if I explained that in that episode or not. A old sci fi show from back uh when two thousands. And uh yeah, you know the made it's like Frack uh from Battlestar Galactica. So anyway, that's what's in my head right now uh, when it comes to the uh, pretend swearing. And let's go see. I, I'm general now. 
That better be me a pay increase in the Brotherhood, or the Brotherhood's gonna be like, you are working with mercenaries, you bad. What do you got to say to me? What do you got to say? Glad to see you alive and well, sir. Are we in luck, sir? Mission accomplished. We have the transmitter. Finally, some good news for a change. Nice work, sir. I didn't do it alone. Yeah, Ellen, that's right. Reese, it's time to welcome our newest recruit to the recon team. She shows a lot of promise, and with the proper guidance, I think she has the potential of becoming one of the best. One of the best. Around. Nothing's ever going to keep me down. Recon, huh? So, what are we looking for? Don't worry about it. Talk to Reese and I after we're done here, and we'll explain everything. So you decided to stay, huh? I expected you to take your payment and run. Are you upset? Are you upset that I'm staying? Maybe. Got enough trouble stomping muties and ferals. I don't need something else to worry about. Reese, that's enough. Like it or not, you're going to have to learn to work together. And you, you need to understand what it means to be a part of the Brotherhood. We're not soldiers of fortune. We're an army. And we've dedicated our lives to uphold a strict code of ethics. If you intend mm -hmm. to stay within our ranks, you need to obey our tenets without question. Code of ethics? You're going to teach me this code of ethics? If you were paying attention in Arcjet, you should have learned some of it already. The rest Step into fire? I'm apparent as you spend time with your fellow soldiers. The stepping into fire is Since I know you're eager to get started, I'll get right to the point. I only ask for two things from anyone under my command honesty and respect. You fall in line, you stay in line. I give you an order, and you follow it. It's as simple as that. Now, before I release you to Halen and Reese for your assignments, there's one last order of business. From this moment forward, I'm granting you the rank of Initiate. This is only a training rank. I'm not permitted to grant ranks any higher than that. Not permitted? Why can't you promote me beyond Initiate? Only an Elder can promote you beyond Initiate. After we get the transmitter up and running, I'll call in and see what I can do. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks are necessary. Just continue excelling at your duties, soldier. Ad Victorium, Initiate. She doesn't even know what that means, Halen. Ad Victorium means to victory. In our eyes, defeat is unacceptable. Because we're fighting for the future of mankind. Our rallying cry is more powerful than any weapon you could ever carry. Remember that. Now, mm -hmm. I need you to report to Halen or Reese for your next assignment. Dismissed, soldier. Okay. Well, they don't simper and victa. Simperfy? No, that's Marines. So, do you care that I'm hanging out with the Minutemen? Dance. The sooner Halen gets that transmitter and stuff. Yeah, of better. course. Yeah. Hey, wake up. Wake up. Kick him. Kick him. Little witchy's all the way settled down. Hey there. All right, out with it. What's your game? <laughs> game? Game? What do you mean? What's a game? I size people up at a glance, but you, you're different. And it's bugging the heck out of me. You're not the military type. You're a loner. So I can't figure out why you're sticking around. You got what you wanted, so why don't you hit the road? Uh. The Brotherhood yeah. might be the best chance I'll ever have. To find my son. Well, as far as reasons go, that's a pretty good one. Yeah, shut you down. Look, I'm gonna cut you some slack because Dance trusts you. But if you step out of line and put any of my brothers or sisters in danger, I'll make sure you regret it. So, ready for your assignment, Kiro? Yeah, well, uh, sure. What's your problem? My problem is I can't figure oh. out. You come from out of. Uh -huh. I don't know oh, if you're sorry. serious about being a part of the Brotherhood. Or you're just biding your time until you find whatever it is you're looking for. Either way, find out. until you tuck a few of these assignments under your belt, I'm gonna be keeping my eye on you. Now, you ready to? Yeah, 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 yeah. Ready. Then listen up. Like it or not, one of our most important duties is to keep the Commonwealth clear of the trash. I'm talking about mutants, ghouls, synths, the abominations the damn eggheads caused when they started playing with their toys. This op is simple. I'm gonna send you to a target. And you're gonna terminate everything that calls it home. All the details you need are right here. Don't come back until the job's done. Well. Okay. Commonwealth. Cleansing the Commonwealth. Clear out College Square. What about you? You got something for me? Scribe Halen. 
Re still giving you the cold shoulder. Why does he hate me? He doesn't hate you. Reese bleeds brotherhood. <laughs> it's all he cares about. It's his family. It's his whole life. If anything else comes into the picture and gets in the way, he shoves it aside. Oh, yeah, she'll, ne she'll never answer this. Is there something between the two of you? That's none of your business. Look, <sighs> just give Reese some time. <laughs> I'm sure he'll see you're a valuable member of the team and he'll come around. So, are you ready to take on your first assignment? What, what exactly does a scribe do for the Brotherhood? We do everything that the pilots and the soldiers need to keep all of their operations running. All the scientific research, the repairs, the tactical planning, you name it. <laughs> we do all of the technical work. Of course, I'm a field scribe, so I'm boots on the ground with the soldiers, but I kind of like pulling the trigger every once in a while. Oh, baby. Anyway, I won't bore you with any more of the details. Yar. Ready. Great. Let me explain what I need you to do. One of the Brotherhood's most important duties is the recovery and preservation of technology that was lost when the bombs fell. I have a list of locations that contain artifacts we need you to recover in order to have them cataloged and studied by our scribes. Here, this should cover all the information you'll need to find your first artifact. Good luck, and be careful. Okay, quartermastery. Anything else? Paladin dance. I'm busy right now, Initiate. Of course Perhaps you are. Speak later. Uh, Where I come from, you get orders, you carry them out. Now move it. <laughs> okay, what's this look like? Step on him. Jump on him. Why is he doing push ups? Give me on. Give me more, soldier. Ah. Hey, I'm a general, okay? Make me an initiate. Come on. Yep, this is a good use of my time. Alright, so. <laughs> moving forward. Uh, I got a whole bunch of things I can do. I already take everything that I could from here, probably. You guys aren't selling anything, right? Excuse me, Scribe Halen. Bring that artifact back here as soon okay, as possible. Okay, okay. Gotcha. What? So, looking at our inventory. Cleanse of the Commonwealth. I think that's, like, really close. Uh, so, yeah. Quarter Mastery, support the Brotherhood Recon Team. Well, that's kind of, like, all the time, right? Um, okay. So, into the wrong hands. Well, let's let's just work on the first thing I think we'll do is we'll do cleansing the Commonwealth. And we'll start this up right now. Out we go. Cause I'm pretty sure it's like right over here. In fact, uh because I had to redo an episode, I think I might have forgot I have to go talk to a couple people who end up being around here. But if I look at the mop Really? That's oh that's the bluff. Okay, I guess I'm, I have multiple places. So finish up cleansing College Square. Uh and I'm gonna equip the uh good rifle for a while. Ah, so I have to go underground. Right? Yeah, okay, here's the subway tunnel. Ah, the subways. The uh, place to be. It's College Square. I'm pretty terrible at stealth, and I think I should keep these lights on for the sake of YouTube's summons dark. It darkens up the quality of videos. Hey, look, some dead ghouls. Um, it darkens up videos quite a bit. Uh, so, I will keep this on for as long as I can. Um, or I'll try to whenever things are... Really? Come on! I call Tom Fullery on that. So, do I, can I, t I see my battle damage? When I don't have this on? Eh, not really. Uh, yep, I know I'm wounded. So we go to here. And we go, yo! Stim pack? God, I blew up my whole left side. And I forgot how to do targeted stuff here. Or do I have to wait for it to take effect? Uh, okay. Alright, that healed up some things. So, yeah, we gotta be careful. And, uh... We'll take, it, take it on. Alright, uh, let's see what we got. 
The textures are really have quite improved. I mean, there's a lot of great things about this. At the very least, ooh, lordy. Excellent. Hey, there we go. <laughs> if I can't hit, Mysterious Stranger can. Trying to be hidden with a uh, light, um, with your flashlight on is. <laughs> Boom! There we go. That's why you have Critical Banker, that little star was that right there. Alright. Um, although. I'm really looking at these guys, and I'm not thinking they're that much of a threat. So we'll start rocking the cheaper stuff that we have around. Feather Duster. Oh, God! <laughs> that scared the hell out of me. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. There we go. Oh! There we go. Okay. Am I still... Whoa, okay. Oh, well, that's right. Gotta remember to hit quick save in case the game freezes, because previous things I mentioned, this is Bethesda game. That's just how it goes. In fact, uh, pretty much you just gotta be happy anytime you have uh, haven't crashed after a period of, I don't know, an hour? Yeah. Well, I don't know. That's probably being a little too harsh on it. Um, it all depends on what your system specs are. I don't have the greatest system specs. Um, I have a 970 for a card. I think I probably should post that one these days. People probably would be very interested in knowing that. Wait, this is breaking into somewhere? Well, all the more reason to do it. Darn it. XP. So that was breaking in somewhere. Yet coming in here is not Stimpak, Subway Token. Hey, who knows? Maybe there's places use currency like that. Oh boy. Time to test this. Booty. Okay, there's no O's in the middle of it. And does it start with a B? So let's try games. No. Uh, does it start with a G? So let's try. Yeah, okay. If you get no unlocks in the first try, just go again. <laughs> usually, man. Oh, error. Is the way I usually like to go. And going with a word that has multiple E's in it, so it's not going to have two E's. I mean, there's a lot of different ways to go. So it could basically could end in it, end there, could have a lot of different things going for it. Similar word. Nothing's really jumping out of me. So it could have an E in the middle of it, maybe, or an R, the second letter. Wow, just nothing's coming to me right now. So it's got to have it, the E in the middle of it. James? That's it. All right. Protection control. Now, I've seen this a few times already. It's activate the personality mode for things. Uh, law enforcement subway steward. Sure. And then we activate units. Hello. Citizen, please present your subway token. I got attention. Oh, what? That is not cool. <laughs> you know, I gotta tell you, I'm not, I'm not cool with that. You made a powerful enemy this day, Protectron. This notice required by law. 
Wow, it's almost killed me. Okay. <laughs> Down he went. Alright. So, that was not a good idea. Got my subway token back, though. Um, yippee. <laughs> what? There's more? Okay. Woo! Go, go, Protectrons. Molotov cocktails are probably not the ideal way to take these guys. They, they, uh, probably not the ideal way to take these guys on. All right, let's go a little bit further. Head over there. Let's see what we got. As I look and see, I think I'm actually probably one of my um, common. There's always something, right? One of the common things I always like to screw up is forgetting to more rat meat, muck chops. Is um forgetting to start my recorder, so this episode runs a little long. We're a little long. Bam. Good level up. Boom. Alright, there we go. Oh yeah, more coming, huh? Uh, oh no! It's come falling through the universe. Take that right arm. There we go. Mysterious Stranger for the win. <laughs> I gotta admit, I love the Mysterious Stranger perk. Uh, oh yeah, is there any more comments? Nope, looks like we got them all. these wooden block INDs are. I should really pay attention here. Um, okay, so let's level up, and I think as we level up, we'll probably call this episode to wrap up the rest of this, because I don't know how long these tunnels are going to go. Um, that's kind of the joy of playing the same blind for everyone. You get to see all the terrible mistakes I make, and there will be many. And, uh, yeah, we'll see how it all goes, but I know I haven't finished clearing this place out yet. So thank you very much for joining me for this episode. Let's level up and then call it a day. Uh, pickpocket, yeah. Um, locksmith was requiring a higher, higher. We've just reached level 10 and we gotta remember level 11 is reserved for idiot savant. So, a lot of our luck based stuff is kind of there. I mean, there's scavenge, which is kind of all right. But at this point, it's like, I kind of feel like I want to maybe boost some of my base skills so that, I mean, there's, uh, they take more damage and easier to pacify. I'm never going to get that, but they're easier to persuade in dialogue. But my curse was crap anyway. I think because I seem to just be using guns regardless and such, we're just going to choose another rank in agility training. So that way we can do stuff like action girl, getting more action points is always good, plus there's always being able to run effectively. There's so many cool things you can do here. So anyway, thank you very much for joining us, uh, joining us, joining myself for this episode of Fallout 4. I uh, hope everyone has a good day and like if you enjoyed the video. Uh, more of these coming out pretty much as soon as I make them. I try loading them up. Take care, y'all. Cheers.